Uh, I start with a presentation. Look at him. Look at him. All the time. Look at him. Yeah. yeah. Hola a todos, soy Rob Diesel, estoy aquí en Barcelona con la gran estrella, mi Silvia Saint. Bueno, Silvia, hey. how are you? Good, what about you? <laughs> how are you? Can I ask you one question? What is the Toros? Is the bull bulls? <laughs> I'm one of the Toros. <laughs> you have to see me in action first. Yeah, I have to check some movies. <laughs> <laughs> so you like Barcelona or what? I love Barcelona. Yeah. I'm, I've been here many times, you know, so yeah. mostly time for work. But mostly anyway, time for work, mostly time, but a few times for vacation, like twice. Yeah. Only. And pleasure as well. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> so, Sylvia, um, what are you doing these days in terms of work and everything? These days I'm, um, I'm producing most of them, you know, uh, producing like uh, for the internet website, yeah. you know, I c make uh, castings, mm -hmm. uh, but all the, all the content is just about the girls, you know, and still I'm working as a like model, you know, I'm working uh -huh. with the girls and, you know, still. But you're living in Praga, right? Yeah, I live in yeah. Prague, yeah. But you're traveling a lot to the States still? Yep. Or? Uh, not, not, uh, not a lot like before, you know, like most of the time I, I'm in the Europe. Yeah. And uh, when it's very necessary, I go to LA. But uh, you know, I, I run my business from Prague. You know. <laughs> Sounds good, huh? Mm? Yeah. So, what's your plans for short and long time future? Wow, you know, I just I live in the moment. I don't planning, you know, now. But I mean, like, I will still working like behind the camera. Mostly, time in the future, I will be more and more behind the camera. And. Uh, I don't want to do any. I don't want to be any producer, like make DVDs or movies. No, I will still no. continue or concentrate for the internet, you know. Yeah. But step by step, right now I'm always from the camera. But step by step, I will be also more. Yeah. What's your secret for being this beautiful? I you cannot know, tell you. Year after year. <laughs> <laughs> hard work, hard work, you know. <laughs> so be hard work, right? Yeah, I like to take care about me, you know, yeah. and you know. Well, you've noticed. Mm? <laughs> So Sylvia, you missed the times when you were a porn star. I don't like the question, but I mean, I mean, for me, you're still a porn star. So because I'm still in the, in yeah, the industry, exactly. you know, I, I I really don't quit completely. So but you missed the times where you were more <coughs> working during your scenes and shows and everything. Um, because I'm always around the people, so I don't think like I missed the time. You never really That's left the business. No, really so. not, really not. Oh, okay, for one year. Like 2001 and 2002, I heavily break that I really don't do nothing, just enjoy the life and okay. uh, spend money. <laughs> mm -hmm. But uh, when you run out of money and you start it again, <laughs> <laughs> you know, uh, I like to make money like everybody, mm -hmm. you know. Right. So then you have an easy life. So tell us the three films or movies in your career that you really can recommend us. Uh, one of the biggest movies was from uh, Private, mm -hmm. the Uranus experiment that we do the sex in zero gravity. Wow. It was a really great experiment. Yeah, really. Then there was the Danger Things, which we shoot in Brazil. Mm -hmm. And there was another movie, was Robinson Crusoe. Yeah. It was also great. But, uh, you know, I have a lot of movies which which uh, people which people know but this one was really great for me because it was a lot of traveling uh, special for the Uranus experiment mm -hmm. we shoot this in Sweden yeah, really? mm -hmm. oh. we have a, swi a sw My Swedish country. pilot pilots <laughs> yeah and it was very for me it was easy but for the guy it was but very no difficult actors, right? uh, one oh. of the guy was Swedish but uh, he was brand new he don't stay in the business for a long time okay. but the rest was from people from America and from yeah. Europe you know so I mean, for guys it's not easy to work in zero grade uh, not like e <laughs> I think not even uh, in zero grade oh. because uh, I think I think uh, people are not correct to the guys, you know. Yeah, you know, exactly. the girls get paid better than the men, and it's not it correct. It it's not correct <laughs> because the guys working really hard. Believe me. We do actually. We do. <laughs> so, and there's many other movies, you know. Like I was mm. working with a pleasure production. I was working with a Jill Kelly, mm. with Rocco Sifredi, uh, Peter so you Nord. You like watching a movie, so. Yeah, I like yeah. to watching movies. Yeah, but uh, before I uh, watching more for pleasure pleasure and yeah, now yeah, I watching more like <laughs> I comment <laughs> this and yeah, that yeah, you course. know so I watching yeah. it more in professional way no I mean if you see porn every day 
year after year after year after a while. It's to me, it's, it's to me it's like it's somebody it's watched the normal. Disneyland yeah, channel, exactly. you know. <laughs> I know, I know how it works. So Sylvia, in these times and the way things are now, would you start again from zero in this business? I will start again. Yeah. Because uh, everything, even the business, uh, when I started was for a reason. You know, everything bad with what I did in my life was for some oh. reason. So, mm -hmm. and I like sex and other things around this, so I like to experiment, so I will start again. Sounds good. Hmm? Sounds good. <laughs> so what do you think has changed most in the last years in the world of porn? Uh, there have changed a lot of things because before, let's say 15 years ago when I start, we did like, let's say regular movie, very simple, boy, girl, two oh, girls, okay. boy, uh, nothing bizarre, nothing nasty. Now yeah. people, I think when I check the web sizes and the movies, people do, don't know the limit. They try to do uh, more uh, kinky and uh, naughty and uh, bizarre like things. Everybody's seen everything, so yeah. they need something yeah. more. And, and you know. I think some things are not uh, really exciting, oh, no. you know, because I it's think, uh, too uh, much. They go too far sometimes. Yeah, and it's, it's go too far and, uh, and they don't know uh, where they have to stop. You know, so and sometimes I think they forget about the pleasure and sex, and they, they go too too freaky, and it's it's true. It's not even pleasure and sex anymore. It's just uh, you're right because, for example, when I did the hardcore, people know me from the hardcore movie, yeah, and yeah. when I stop and I start to concentrate for the uh, just the movie with the girls, mm -hmm. uh, the people don't say, "Okay, we don't we don't watch you anymore. We don't want to see you." The people see that we do really good go good work with the girls, and yeah, they they see. continue to oh. watching the movies. You know because. Oh. Uh, I never thought about this that let's do something bizarre and I want the people like me more. No, you know, no, no, so please, it's no. not about it, you know, so. I like it okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so do you think it's necessary to, to live in the States to be successful in the business? I mean, the, because I mean, the, the biggest part of the business works in the States. Yeah, that's right, but so I think it's not necessary to live in LA. Of course, LA, uh, for example, LA on States is a factory for the adult business. Uh, but I think Europe have pretty big market for this also. Yeah. You don't need to go states. Yeah, from the most of the business came from states, but it's ne not necessary. If you are good in the business, if you know what you want to do and how mm -hmm. far you want to go, and go, and if you know who you are, so it's you can be in a but you can be. In the crisis, Sorry. Still now in the crisis. And um, mm, I think the crisis is uh, is. Uh, Mm, it's for few few production for few people it was very bad but mm -hmm. the people who are really strong who go uh -huh. always in one way uh, they uh, they they stay you know uh -huh. so and if you it's the same if you start now in the time uh, and uh, like I say and you know how far you want to know you know your price and everything so you can work even right now you know so you don't uh, it's not about the crisis you know so yeah. maybe have to fight a little more to get what you uh, get what you were want but I mean if you're good, I think in the in the final you're gonna, you're gonna it's reach it. That's true because so if you if you don't do everything like we talked about this before, that some people yeah. really take every job. That's too bad. Yeah, you know, yeah. you're working maybe for one years and then you left. You yeah, know, so. Yeah, exactly. But if you if you have your your way and your vision, what you want to do and everything, so I think you mm -hmm. can be in the business. Like for example, like me, I know exactly from beginning. Okay, not from beginning because I was young and naive in the business. But mm -hmm. uh, after one year, I recognize a lot of things in the industry, and I say, okay, I want to go this way, and I want to ju do just this. You know, mm -hmm. and I concentrate for this, and yeah. I know. Uh, I sometimes I was choosing with who I want to work, yeah. what kind of production, what I want to do. And mm -hmm. if I really don't like something, I, I talk to the producer and I say, I'm sorry, I really don't like it, mm -hmm. you know. But some people in the business, they say, yes, yes, I do everything, you know. So it's uh, it's not about the uh, quantity, it's about the quality, yeah, exactly. you know, so. Um, so do you have a lot of friends in Spain that are in the porn business? Um, like. Uh, I have a from the porn business. Uh, I cannot say a lot of. I know a lot of people, because I uh, I cannot. I know few people who are really my friends who I meet very often. Mm -hmm. But I have a lot of uh, also a lot of people who I know. You know, mm -hmm. for example, I know very well like Sophie Evans. She's uh, really she's one of the really kind girl. I like yeah. her. You know, so. She can be at the party tonight as well. Yeah, I know. I cannot <laughs> wait to see her. <laughs> Yeah, and Spain, you know, I met a lot of people on a, in America also. People, mm. a lot of people working from uh, from Spain. Mm. Uh, I went here many time in the for the erotic festival, mm. so I met uh, always a lot of people. Uh, so I know a lot of people from here. I don't see him them very often, but uh, mm. every, every time when I meet him, also for uh, Mar, uh, 
Max Cortez. You know, it's yeah. nice to see this kind of people because they are really, they are true, you know, I like them. Sophie mm -hmm. and Max, they are really cool people. No, but actually, there are a lot of genuine people in the, in, the, in the business as well. I mean, I have a lot of friends in the business. Mm -hmm. Everybody thinks that because you're in the porn, because you're an actor or actress or whatever, you, you have to be one way, you only think about sex or whatever. But no, you can talk with about normal things part, about it. Yeah, exactly. About about yeah. We're normal people as well. Exactly, we are uh, just a human. <laughs> <laughs> well, well. Sometimes <laughs> we are animals, I know. <laughs> but it's not a rally way. <laughs> you think it's worthwhile in all the time you've been dedicating in the porn business? Mm. It's, uh, you know, nobody will, you know, I don't mm. like when people judge me. You know, when people, uh, for example, when people know you personally, they like you how the way you are, and there is around there's a lot of people who will judge you, yeah, because they don't know you. You yeah. know, they can judge you, but uh, uh, the true people will never say this. True, true. <laughs> so, something about the website, estrellareporno.com. Do you know the website, or? Yeah, I checked the website a couple of times. Yeah. So, what's your opinion about it? So you can, like say, uh, when I check the website, you can find out everything about the adult business, you know, what happened uh, like uh, from in Spain, in America, a lot of interesting, like naughty things, you know, as, <laughs> as you like guys, I know, and, uh, and, uh, we make a lot of articles about you as well, you know that, right? Sorry? We make some articles about you as well, you know, you know that, right? I really see, just few, not a lot. <laughs> 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 Hopefully you do more, yeah. <laughs> So when you call, when you see the website, I think you can find out only the best things. So to finish, you want to dedicate some words to all the fans. You know, I have a lot of fans in yeah. the website and in Spain, right? I think so. Yeah. I think so you because do, do. my website is also in Spanish. So, uh -huh. so yeah, there is a uh, pretty lot of uh, fans. So. Uh, guys, <laughs> it's it's always uh, hard to say something for these questions, you know. Uh, um, um, some nice words. Some nice all words. The, all the guys watching you. I know, but, uh, you know, yeah. the guys know what I want to tell them, but it's so, <laughs> so stupid to say to this camera, like, guys, watch me and blah, blah, blah. Uh, and blah, blah, blah is what? No, I mean... Um... <laughs> <laughs> uh, mm, <laughs> so I'm I'm, hap I'm happy always with the guys who watch me or my my friends in the business that they will bring. I'm happy that we can bring them the pleasure they will like uh, they like. And uh, I'm also happy for the for a lot of people because in the industry we met a lot of uh, handicapped people, yeah, really. right? Uh -huh. And uh, this way, how we do this work, we make uh, you know a lot of people cannot have a sex like we yeah, have, yeah, you know. Yeah. And I think this, bus this uh, business also bring them the, really the right pleasure mm -hmm. for them. And this makes me really happy because especially in Spain, in the, in the FISEP uh, Expo, there we have, uh, there I met a lot of people. You know, mm -hmm. there was like sometime, uh, two years ago, two years ago, there was like group of, a uh, really group of the people in the wheelchair. Mm -hmm. And there was so, there was crying because they can meet oh, us yeah, and everything. Yeah. And it was uh, because uh, yeah, you are happy in the moment that you do the job because you yeah, really help exactly. these the people. So mm -hmm. uh, I don't want that uh, this pleasure have only the people the, from who are healthy, but all, all the people around the world. So we like to make you happy guys, always. Mm -hmm. And you know as well, if you ever think about doing a scene in Spain, you know which actor to choose, right? I will. Rob Diesel. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say loud. <laughs> okay. So. So Sylvia, you're going to the to the party tonight, then? Yeah, we yeah. have a party tonight. Woo! <laughs> you go there also? I'll be there. Okay, we talk a little bit. <laughs> Good. So. It's an honor to be here with you. Thank Spain, you. Barcelona. Mm. Big star, Sylvia Sein. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you.